Hi, it's Gina again. Um, I'm not very good at this video thing. It seems to take me a few tries. So I'm going to try to just get right to it. And uh, I tend to ramble a little bit, so I'm trying not to. Um, I have been looking for common denominators um, and why. Common traits we all have. Um, it's kind of weird because I've been kind of lurking, you know, watching all these videos when I guess I didn't have the guts to make one myself. I was hoping if I just shut my mouth, which I'm still consider this keeping my mouth shut. I do because <clears throat> I'm not mentioning where I live. I'm not mentioning anything. I need to talk to somebody and I'm not going to go around and make myself look stupid. Anyway, common denominators. Um, it seems like a lot of us are artistic, um, like math, science, um, speak mathematically. I have found, like, um, I would say about three or four other females that remind me of me. It's pretty wild. We all like science, math, music. We speak mathematical. We even talk the same. Um, it's really been weird. We all kind of even have the same appearance. It's really strange. I, matter of fact, wonder if they have RH or negative blood. Um, as weird as that sounds, which is all is weird, I do have RH or negative, and I just wonder if all these other females that are in the program that um, remind me of me are also RH or negative. And I say they remind me of me because, well, I'm the oldest. <laughs> One's 21 and I feel really terrible for that girl. Um, I couldn't imagine being 21 and going through this shit. Um, and a couple are 30, I am 47. Mm, heading towards 50. But um, they, I mean, you, you start watching these videos and next thing you know, you're listening to someone that just, I mean, I couldn't believe it when they're talking like me and next thing I know they're speaking mathematically. Um, so that's why I wonder if there is the RHO negative factor. I've read so much about that. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what this is. I know there has got, it's got to be something to this more. Um, we were picked for something. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe revenge. <laughs> I don't really want to go into what I think. I mean, um, I don't know. I don't know what to think about what all this is. Um, it's pretty weird, isn't it? Um, these people can do stuff that it does seem like it's spiritual. Um, technology, yes, but it seems pretty darn spiritual because I don't see how some of this stuff can be done. I really don't. I, I never even read up on technology. I was never into conspiracy theories and, you know, I'm not like, there's anything wrong with it if you are right but I was never into all that until of course this happened so anyway I'm just I guess I just felt like making a video because you are alone and I am not going to go around and try to discredit myself which actually I wouldn't accept that either um I'm sure someone might try to put it that way but you know what um that, I mean, I'm, I'm going to fight like hell for that not to happen. Um, I don't feel good. I, I know a lot of us don't feel good, what, most of the time? Most of the time. I don't know what's going on. Um, you do get the weird dreams. They're almost like training. Um, I can say that much. 
had some really weird dreams for a long period of time. I went into dream study because of it. The dreams have pretty much stopped because I guess because they went into this level. But um, I just wonder about those other females if they're Rh O negative. Um, I think people probably will think it's a trip that like I reply to them like I kind of know them, but they don't know I've been watching their videos like like um, Vulcan. Vulcan, Wolverine, um, Kyle. I mean, I've been listening to that guy's video for almost three years, you know? Over. At least two and a half. So I already feel familiar with him, right? And he's probably like, who, what, you know? Because everyone is so paranoid. And that's another thing. People are going to have to figure something out if you want to have any friends or whatever just gonna have to take that leap of faith um i'm sure that um i don't know i can figure out someone that's trying to gaslight and bait me pretty quick i mean and then it's like see ya. i don't need your friendship that bad <sighs> matter of fact luckily i can keep myself entertained pretty good although i don't feel good most of the time so anyway Good morning, America. Um, it's Gina coming to you live from Paradise. Paradise City. I do have a good sense of humor. Um, it just became rather dry. And plus, when you're sick, 